Hi, I'm Tryon Belisario, and today I'm going to review pop culture's most notorious evil twins. Let's go to the tapes. Oh my god, I forgot he was twins in this movie! Please. Oh my god, guys, the fact that he played twins was something that I really forgot. And the fact that I also forgot that, like, when Leonardo DiCaprio, like, gets really, really upset uh, in some scenes and, like, his voice cracks, it's just, like, magic. No. Wear it until you love it! So, you know, that whole, like, wear it for the rest of your life, I think is just, I'm gonna go home and rewatch that right now. Why are you getting so close to that knife? No! Whoa! What the? Stop stabbing so near to his... No! In the mouth? First of all, what? I'm gonna go ahead and say that the movie Sisters is in fact about somebody who is struggling with something deep within themselves, primarily an urge to murder. That sort of reaction afterwards where she was just like, ah, oh, ah, oh, ah, oh, and just like spaced out into the corner, like classic reaction. Kind of the way that I wake up in the morning where I'm just like, ah, oh, what happened? Also, like, what a waste of a cake. All right. So, okay, here's my biggest question about this scene. Kubrick didn't want to show the young boy who plays Danny the gore. I want to know what he told him to get that reaction where he's like, because it's the greatest reaction. But the Grady twins themselves, were they evil? I don't think they were. I think they were ghosts. I think it's more just like misunderstood ghost. Those are two twins that I would not want to mess with. I think sometimes the, the caveat is like that there's one good twin, one evil twin. The Matrix twins just like both seem like bad guys, which like I, I vibe with. <laughs> I'm sorry. Not twins, right? More just like somebody who's like obsessed with somebody else to the point of personifying them in a really creepy way. This actually happened to a friend of mine uh, and it was really, really not okay. It was definitely a moment of like Highlander, there can be only one. So I'm gonna go ahead and say that Frida maybe was evil or maybe was just obsessed with weather systems. Hard to say, we'll come back to it. Ah! No! All right, now we're in my territory. Love exploring, you know, different forms of psychological drama through the fracturing of the self in the twin. Just like jam with that all day. Really loves good night, mommy. Hell yeah, Lohan. <laughs> the Parent Trap is a classic. Uh, also, Lindsay Lohan is awesome in it. Um, and definitely near and dear to my heart if we're gonna talk about American twins versus British twins. Just really having a ball with that. So, uh, really, really vibe on the parent trap right now. Definitely don't trust that twin in the suit. Uh, I really, really trust the twin in the trench coat though. Like a trench coat is like a classic sign of, I think since like Sherlock Holmes, it's just like trench coat, trench coat means you can trust me. So, don't trust that guy in the suit, though. <laughs> oh, love Phoebe and Ursula. <laughs> Friends, it's so good. Um, I also love, like, the split shot of them where, like, they're just figuring out the technology and, like, she comes out, like, a little bit, like, er, er, er. <laughs> um, definitely an evil twin vibe from Ursula. Phoebe, what a great character. And uh, Lisa Kudrow can do no wrong in my eyes, so definitely vibe on those twins. Oh, God! I'm gonna go ahead and say this might just be like a parallel universe thing because that is weird. Also, uh, like, I need to see Army of Darkness. I've never seen it, but like, uh, that was like a real Lynchian vibe. Oh, Bill and Ted! Oh my God, Bill and Ted! How's it going, Bill and Ted? Stop. I love this movie so much. What we're dealing with here is definitely parallel universes because these, they're not twins, they're just time traveling, but they seem to be having a really good time. So I think that's, uh, I think it's a positive for them. No evil twins here. I think, uh, I think they're just having a, a good time. Whoa. Oh, that's CGI. I mean, God, I hope I never have to fight myself, particularly if I had arms like Arnold Schwarzenegger. 
brutal. What did you do? <laughs> like, you need to examine if your twin wants to punch you, like what have you done in your life to incur that? Because as we've gone over before, it's not necessarily that they might be evil, they might just have different motivations. You might have done something. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Now that you've seen my reviews of some of these amazing films, now you know how I feel about evil twins. So what do you think about these?